Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is Laura with Stitching with Laura. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a great Tuesday. Well, happy Valentine's Day. And we have our Valentine Cup for February. And we're just drinking coffee today. Wow, I got that a little hot this morning. Yep, and Molly's here. Let me see if I can adjust it down. There she is. She's all snuggled up in her blankies because it's about, mm, it said it was 25 degrees, but the wind is blowing at 18, so give or take, it's like 13 degrees. Yeah. This is my 163rd floss tube. Today is February 14th, 2023, and it's 9.15 in the morning. So we did just a few things this week so yeah it was busy oh and before I forget I got this beautiful beautiful card from Sylvia isn't that gorgeous it's got sparklies on it it's gorgeous and yes 550 purple is one of my favorite favorite it's my favorite purple but it's also one of my favorite colors I do love it and I love it stitched on things so thank you Sylvia beautiful beautiful card gorgeous 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 thank you thank you thank you so I will put those to use I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that the purple but I'll think of something yeah so we had four reviews I finally got through all the bags that were late in coming so that's why hence we had four different company reviews and I had an unprecedented four starts yeah I don't know what got into me you know one week I don't do any starts and then the next week boom 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 yeah so yeah let's see where to begin I guess we'll start with one of them that I did or started, I should say. And this is from Colorful DIY. I absolutely love this. It's the fish scape, as I call it. Isn't it gorgeous? It's just gorgeous. It is 100 by 73 centimeters. And I did get it in a bag. So, whoops. We got threads everywhere trying to figure out where of course I am oh here we go so I worked on this a little bit I'll just half unfold it but yeah we just got some green up there and then I got it's like a dark dark green there it was confettied and yeah I didn't get any further so yeah I'll pick it up again. I, I'll keep it out. But I just think the whole thing is just a kaleidoscope of colors. It's just so, so beautiful. Whoa. We just had an avalanche. That'll be a hot moment. Now, the next one I started is from a spring kit. And it was from FG Normal. And I have to take it out of the bag. It's this lovely pot of pink and purple flowers. I went nuts. Yeah, I worked on this for two, maybe three days. And it's the one with, hang on, i got to set things down. As you can see from the back, I did get a lot done. Let me fold it this way so the light doesn't come through. But, hang on, there'll be a moment, there'll be a delay. Hold that thought, please. Try to get the color out of the way so you can see what's going on. But, I basically almost finished those right down through here. I started on this purple one. So, it's coming along very nicely, and I worked right down here in that green colored, but... 
three quarters of that was half stitches, so I was just stitching away. I mean, I just went absolutely ape. Yeah. And, sorry, I have to pick up the avalanche. Hang on. There'll be a second. All right. We'll just put it beside me so it doesn't fall again. And this one was the blue watercolor flowers from FG Normal as well. Aren't they beautiful? Oh, yeah. So, I got using this hot pink here. I didn't like this one as well as I liked the last one I showed. So you can tell because that's all I got done on them. And I want it has big area. It has big areas. The next one has confetti. It's just all in what I'm in the mood for. So, yeah, just barely started it, and I'm holding it upside down. My bad. It goes this way. Holy cow. There you go. But it's going to be gorgeous. I just love it. Just absolutely love it. Let me put that way up there. And. That's we had delay. We're not, I was organized till I had an avalanche. The next one I started, this terrible picture, uh, was the blue dragon. The picture that I used for the the stitch along is so much better. But you get the point. So yeah, I went crazy on this one too. Hang on. Let me fold it and I started doing the black it's not black it's eight eight two three and nine three nine up here so I started doing that as you can tell I got bored so I had to go do something else but I've been working on the the wing part and it's turning out beautiful just absolutely stunning I did see another one in a different color and I can't even remember what the color was but it's not the same picture. I mean, it's just another dragon with the dark background. So, eh, maybe, maybe not. Not real sure if I'll get that. Yeah. So those are the four starts that we had. And I might as well get this on here. I know, there's lots of moving and stretching. Sorry. We did have European Town Saturday. And I worked on... Hang on, let me just fold it back on the roof there so it's coming along very nice I just love this it's yeah it, it's like an all-day sucker I love it but I don't stitch on it all day I just I whew. yeah it has big places in it so I mean it's not confetti so I don't know why I don't work on it more but it's just daunting I think it, it's daunting because it's so big. I try not to think of the hole. Just think of where you're stitching. And just stitch. Yeah. Then last night. I got out. My 18 count peonies. From DP Clubs. And as you know. I've started on this side. So yeah. And I gave it a few threads. I'm working on these red peonies right make sure I got it right side up this time right in here so just put in a little bit more and then I thought well I really want to work on the leaves if you want progress this ain't ain't your game because I put in two threads and you can barely see where I stitched you know it, it's start and then it, my eyes got tired, and I went, nope, can't do this. So, yeah. But I do like it. I'll, I'll pick it up and put a couple threads in it. And, you know, when I feel like working on something that small, I can actually see the, the, the symbols. You know, if I just take it easy, and when I got patience going, you know, it is what it is. Then we also worked on this one. Sorry. And 
It is from Diamond Art Decor. I wrote that on this paper for that very reason. And it's not it it's it's not difficult. We did work, you know, on the video on the yellow, so you can't hardly really tell where the yellow was. And then I got out another thread because I was sick of looking at yellow and, yellow and red. And you can barely see where I got the colors in there. So I put in a thread of that. And it's an 11 count, so just keep working on things little by little. And as if the 18 count wasn't bad enough, I thought, well, I'll just pick up Louise Cullimore. So, I started to work on the queue, and my eyes were really, really tired because somewhere I messed up, and I'll have to fix it. But, yeah. When you're tired, don't stitch. Well, that's at least my, my game. Because it, no. No. And that is everything that we started or that we worked on this week. Got no ideas about next week? Not a clue. So, yeah. But other than that, I think that is like totally everything that we worked on. I, sorry I had so many starts. I just felt like looking at something different, I guess. I don't know. I had that whole, what was it, two weeks of peonies and ancient women. I had to do something a little bit different. And I like that 18 count, that that one. I, I don't know where I put the other 18 count, but it, it's superfluous. Because I didn't like it as well. It was more confetti and very hard to read or see the symbols. So this one is just fine. It's got some nice big areas and, you know, you can see the symbols. So I don't know how things are different. I, I got nothing. I don't know. But I don't know what we're going to be working on this week. Probably regular stitch with me's and I'll probably have some shorts in there. And if it snows, it's supposed to snow three inches tonight, and six inches another day, and seven another, and I'm like, okay. Yeah, whether we get one inch, or none, or or we get a foot. I, I got nothing, because they change their minds all the time. But that is all that we did this week. So, that was enough. Yeah. I wish I had more. But, yeah, we're just sitting here waiting for the snow to arrive. and Of course, it'll start snowing or looking bad about the time I have to go to work because I work 2 to 2.15 to 9.15 tonight. So, we'll see. We will see. All right, guys. Well, thank you for joining me, and thank you for all your lovely comments. Thank you for telling me about all your projects that you're working on. I really like that. And... Thank you for subscribing and following me. And, you know, this is a journey. It might not be the smoothest of journeys, but, yeah, it's supposed to be a journey. Yeah. Have a good day. Thank you for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And please hit the bell. That way you'll know when my next video comes out. Stay safe. Stay healthy. We'll see you next time. God bless. Bye-bye. Keep stitching.